They may be back open, but hundreds of local restaurants are on the brink and need help, and Michigan lawmakers are fighting to get it for them. It's called the Restaurant Act, and it's aimed at keeping locally owned independent restaurants afloat during the pandemic. A group of Michigan lawmakers is sponsoring the bill as PPE or PPP loans are running out. As our Grant Herms reports, the bill has bipartisan support, but it's hit a roadblock in Washington. It's no secret restaurants have struggled to weather the pandemic. And while new service options and some government stimulus have helped, small restaurant owners are saying it's just not enough when they're calling for the passage of a new bill co-sponsored by Michigan members of Congress that's hit roadblocks in Washington. For nearly 100 years, Zingerman's has been part of life in Ann Arbor, but the pandemic has rocked the landmark deli and its community. The restaurant, the cafe, the local Diner, those are places that really have created a lot of that fabric of connection and community. It's why Zingerman's co-founder Ari Weinsweig has pushed for the passage of the Restaurant Act, saying small restaurants need more help as bills pile up and dining rooms stay empty. The PPP loans were awesome, but they basically got you a mile and a half over a 10 mile bridge, a 10 mile wide river. And so the, the bridge is, run, is running out and there's still eight and a half miles to get across. The measure would set aside $120 billion to help prop up the independent restaurant industry and the millions of workers who've lost their jobs over the last few months. But despite bipartisan support in both the House and Senate, the bill hasn't been heard by the House. Last month, Representative Debbie Dingell defended the bill in a Facebook panel with restaurant owners, including Weinsweig. Restaurants are the backbone of so many of our communities. We've got to make sure we keep them strong. It's also unclear whether it's part of the strained negotiations between the White House and congressional Democrats, as time for restaurants is running out. This is tough. I mean, and I, I believe and hope we will get through this at Zingerman's, but it's not going to be easy. Three other members of Congress and both the Michigan senators alongside Dingle have co-signed the bill. More information about the Restaurants Act is on clickondetroit.com. In Greektown, Grant Herms, Local 4.